Asia and Africans originated the casting of lots. Items like bone, a cowry shell, piece of cloth, all have over a dozen different meanings. This is a form of higher mathematics. You can see them there and that enter quantum mechanics. A high estimates probability and chance correlates with quantum physics. At this point, uh, this offers an explanation of the world on the smallest scale, proving uh, that casting lots is a communication practice that defies time in a manner uh, that fundamentally dismantles implications of ordinary logic. It is scientific and truly counterintuitive. All quantum uh, themes are similar to those of casting lots in all probabilities. You can see that's a mathematical chart. When you cast a dice, you come up with 64 permutations out of which you should be able to uh, provide interpretations. And it's called entanglement, which has been explored in the last 30 years and poses an omnipresent randomness capable of manifesting itself simultaneously in more than one places at one time. Here's what uh, James Oxman, uh, PhD uh, physics, said. In a few decades, scientists have gone from a conviction uh, that there is no such thing as an energy field around the human body to an absolute certainty that it exists. Moreover, science is explaining uh, the roles of energy fields in health and disease. This is exactly what all our ancient ancestors knew via systems or of Sangoma, systems of uh, trains and many, many other philosophical angles. A Sangoma enters uh, this quantum world or this world uh, via trance. Such astonishing non-locality is more than just an abstract curiosity or paradox. It is entirely down to earth applications in casting lots. The Nganga, for example, reveals information demonstrating a certain quantum teleportation whose infinite possibilities even science fiction writers are not capable of even imagining. There is an image of how quantum physics approves the supernatural of consciousness during the out-of-body experience. It's very clear. You can uh, find it on this uh, website that is shown there. You study a little bit of quantum physics and you will come out with this understanding that our ancestors showed us how to reconnect into the frequencies or frequency above, casting lots is indeed divine and follows certain divine laws. Offers answers if done rightly, yes. As our quantum are realists, our ancestors proved beyond any reasonable doubt. Thank you all. Siabonga, Siabonga, Tatenda, Prestige Rabbi, Ellen Dumizulu of Committee If you Ethics. Subscribe to our channel and let us walk at this journey together. Visit our website, Life Spirit of Amen Hem. You can visit our website, Life Spirit of Amen Hem. You can contact us on olmdubizulu at gmail.com. Thank you. Goodbye.